Hi everyone, it's Claire here from One Entity. Um, we've come to our secret location, which some of you know because I came on Thursday and give you a bit of a glimpse. Today we've got our one and only Danielle from One Hi. Entity, and we've got Mommy J from One Entity. Okay, so anyway, here we are, and okay, we've actually got into this location now. Not like before where I was walking up and down trying to find how to get in. We've uh, actually managed to get in. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn you around now because you don't want to be staring at my face when we're investigating. So let me turn around and you can see. Right, so here we are. There's our Danielle. There's our Mommy Jay. Now, as you can see, um, this is a bloody wasted place because we've got these absolutely, which would have been stunning. How old do you reckon? 1800s before that? 17s. Very old. Absolutely ridiculously old. So, what I'm going to do, it is a bit of a death trap, but we don't really care because... We're hardcore, aren't we? <laughs> um, I'm just going to show you these bits that we can't get into. Um, if What's happened? Huh? The door's just shut itself. Okay, so it's starting already. Um, we've only been here for 10 minutes, literally. And one of the doors has just shut on its own. Um, as you can see from inside of here, this is what we're dealing with. That's just one little bit. I do want to go in. I'm going in. Let me just move these brambles out of the way. And I'm going in. I don't care. Now, I don't research into the history of things because I refuse. I want to find out from you guys. I don't like saying guys, that's really bad from everybody who's on here, what you feel, what you see. Hello, Anne. Hello, Gillian. Thank you so much for joining us. Okay, there was a bang over there. Right, yeah, I want as much interaction from everybody as possible, because this is, it's not just our night, this is your night, and I really, really want you to show me, tell me what you feel, if you're picking anything up. If I've missed something, Please just shout out, just tell us. I mean, that'd be funny, but this is like the weirdest feeling in here. Hiya, Sammy. How you doing, sweetie pie? Oh, God. Heart's actually pounding in here. This is going to be really odd later when it gets dark thank you Gillian I really appreciate it hello the other half of our team how are you gorgeouses just made a word up by the way gorgeouses <laughs> oh god whoa I just heard something. Okay, I'm gonna get out of this bit just for a minute. Look at the step, look at this, look at this. Right, I'm getting out of this one. That is weird in there. Really weird. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go. What happened? So the door shut on you? Yeah. I've done it again. Oh, it's it's still, is it, it's is it on an angle? Right, I'm gonna go over here. Good evening, everybody. Okay, I think this door's got a mind of its own. Now, hold on, I've got to check it first. Right, so the door's open. Right, I'm going in a bit. Got to be careful in this one because it's all right. As you can see, this is a bit um, a bit bonkers near. Hi Carl, how are you sugar? Um, yeah. 
this is uh, unreal, I've got to be honest with you. And if you look up, that, there's a little gap there, that would have been the upstairs, which as you can see, um, there are no stairs. Good evening, entity. Good evening, honey. Yeah, now this is a bit un unreal, actually. <laughs> um, and yeah, we're not supposed to be in here, I'm not going to lie. Um, we're really not. It has got warnings everywhere that it's extremely dangerous, but we're not going to be silly with it. We're just going to enjoy it. Did you, Anne? Where did you see someone? Right at the bottom. Where was it? Where? We just we something. Who saw? Where? Blah, 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 blah. Was it Anne? Anne, did you see something at the bottom? Hello, honey. Thank you so much for joining us. It's very much appreciated. Um, like I said, this is a, a secret location. Um, at the end of the investigation, I will be very, very honest with you and tell you where it is. Especially for no, I won't. Especially for all of you uh, paranormal people out there, because I know how exciting it is to find um, random locations that no one's ever been to before. And I can honestly say, hand on heart, no one has ever been to this location, like ever. Right, I'm coming back out. Now this is gonna take on a completely different feel again. And it's very, it's got a very dark feeling anyway. You, I don't like that room either. Danielle's just said, because there's a room when you first get in, it's only small, but my God, as soon as you get near it, you feel like your heart starts again. It's that feeling again. It's that suppressive feeling. Now look at this. Look at that. Look at it. I mean, that in itself. That in itself could have had, it could have things inside it. We don't know. But do you know what? I've driven past this place. There is, isn't there, Gillian? Definitely. I've driven past this place so many times in my life, and every time. You must know this, honestly. Again, all you para paranormal people, when you go past a certain place, even as a child, you never forget it. And it's almost like you have to go back. Something draws you, but I've never been able to because people have built things on here. Um, I think it was a timber yard over there. Look, I'll show you a joinery over there. And obviously, you can't get on it then because it belongs to people. That's completely shut down now. So, no one is here. What's the joinery? Yeah. All right, I want to show them this little room first because this room has got a weird feeling. And and I've actually got my SLS today in my ghost bag. Right, are you ready for this? Because this is weird. It's not very big, but oh. Who was that? What? Yeah. Oh, was, was she standing behind me then? Yeah. I did go and ask him and I think she was on the other room. Joanne? I'm guessing that that comment there is off you. <laughs> no swearing on my live, missus. <laughs> Sorry if I've missed any names. Hi, Judy. Sorry. I'm just laughing at Joanne from uh, Birmingham Ghost Hunters. She's helping out today. So if there's anyone on the team with Tourette's, it's going to be Joanne. Is that right, Jo? <laughs> now, this room, look at it. 
Mm. I didn't see an orb, but I definitely felt someone standing behind me. I thought you was behind me when no. I came in here. I saw a light flash by you. Right, okay. I asked And she's terrible, isn't she? Okay, now. Oh, oh, there's a funny feeling in here. There is. This is a bit. It's a bit strange. No, Joe, honestly, you're making me laugh. Okay, so, what I'm gonna do. Now, Danielle has got an ability, but she won't use it. She doesn't know how to use it. She's definitely got it, because every time she's around, she gets sensations and feelings, but sometimes she gets them mixed up with emotion. Oh, and trust me, I will. It's going to be a giggle. Oh, I'm sorry, Gillian. Sorry. Are you, am I back now? Right, well, we've only been here for 10 minutes, Sammy, because what we've done is we went over to the big building first to get a, a bit of a feel. Now, over at the big building, which we're going to go over to when it gets really dark, we've actually experienced something really weird like really weird um me and danielle were looking in that big barn which i showed you on thursday and we both saw something floating now we've taken loads and loads of photos so we're hoping that we've caught something it started off it looked like the head and shoulders of a man but then within seconds it turned to like a cloud shape does that make sense um but yeah, you could see it as clear as day. And Danielle was looking at it, we were describing the exact same thing, the way it was moving from side to side. Um, yeah, it was bizarre. So we had a little walk around there and then came here because it's hard to get in here. So I've had to get um, the ladies to do a little bit of climbing, <laughs> bless them, to get in here. But do you know what? We're in, aren't we? And the darker it gets, the better it's gonna be. Do you know what? They don't have worry. Oh, Sam, honestly, she's clicking away like a good one. I've got an absolute fascination with this one here. I've got, I've got a feeling here. Look at this one. I've just, oh. Look at this. Again. Now, come night time, this is going to be amazing. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, I think you're right, Joe. Maybe. Tone it down a bit. <laughs> Hi, Gillian. Am I back now? Yeah, if I do break up or anything happens, please just let me know and I'll move to a different location. Hi, Maggie. Thanks for joining. Do you know what? I'm going to let the cat out of the bag because I don't really care. Does that, do any of you know Kozel at all? Hi, John. Over here? In overalls? They look like the green, the green overalls. Hi Naomi. Oh, okay, Gillian, that's fine. You dropped your phone, bless you. That's okay. Um, oh, right, so you know Kozel. Okay. 
You go past Woodland Cemetery, you keep going away from um, like um, Castle Bromwich Way, the other direction. And these are on your right, one's on your right hand side and one's on your left hand side. So if there are any paranormal teams out there that fancy a go, I'd do it because these are going to be knocked down. And this is one hell of a place. Hold on, I've just heard some ink up here. No, that's a bird. I know that. No, I heard something over here. Hi Dara. Have I said your name right? I hope I have, so I'm sorry if I haven't. Um, yeah. I heard something over here. Yeah, we can't be too loud because there is actually a house over the way. Um, Got to be careful. Now, I don't know. I don't know the story of this, right? But come and look at the state of this. Got to be careful because the house is over there. So this, obviously, you can see it's been burnt down. I say burnt down, it's still standing, but it looks like it's about to collapse any time. So we're not. Don't worry, Sam. We're going to be good. Well, they will be. I won't be. Okay. Right, I'm going to turn it around to go. Bloody hell, look at that sky. That is beautiful, that, isn't it? Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, I need to get away from this house. If we get back into the middle, if we get back into the middle, we're going to have a little call out. We're going to try and get everything moving before um, before obviously it gets really dark because we want it to be as active as possible. <sighs> Naomi, yeah, we, we did. We did in the other one. We haven't been here that long, but we've heard oh, there's footsteps. I felt like there's somebody standing behind me. There's definitely people watching. Honestly, there's definitely eyes, there's eyes on us, isn't there? And it's a, a bloody strange feeling. Good evening, Maggie. Thank you for joining us, sweet. <laughs> oh, yeah, it come up as Danielle. I thought you'd done it. I thought you were joining the group from here. Okay, must be so Hi, Ben. Too. Sorry. Oh, no, Didn't mean to ignore you, even though you've come up as Danielle. Okay. Um, so we're just going to stand over here and do a bit of calling out for a minute and say, Hi, George. How you doing, sweet? Thank you so much for coming on. Okay. Right. Is there anybody here with us, please? Hi, Mandy. If there's somebody here, can you... Move that door again. Or can you throw a stone? How has that door stayed open when it's shut twice? Oh, hold on. Did you hear that? Thank you so much, but can you do it again, please? Do you know, I, the workmen thing, you're not wrong, you know. But it doesn't feel like it's from now. It does feel like it's a long time ago. Whatever was here before, it's, it feels very suppressive. What was that? Was that from inside? What was it? What, like a, a, a breath? Hi, Christine. How you doing, sweet? Can't believe you're on here. <laughs> Didn't know you was into the paranormal. OK. 
Okay, uh, my mum's just heard like a... Oh, did anyone see a shadow down there? A male type overalls in blue, about five foot four. Okay, thank you, Carl. Well, we'll go back. It does, do you know what? Honestly, this, this place is amazing. Yeah, it is dangerous, I'm not gonna lie. But for you hardy, paranormal folk, you'd bloody love it here. You stand in between the buildings. See, up my head's up all over the place. The only th I just saw a shadow walk past. But my head was literally, I'm looking around everywhere. So this is why I need you all. Hi, Carone. Shadow moved. Other building down the bottom. That's where the fire was. That's what, do you know what? Where the gap is, where the door is going into where the burnt building is, is where I saw a dark shadow walk past. So I wonder if somebody's been killed there. Because no, there's no stories to this building. You won't, you won't find out anything. I promise you now, you won't find out anything. And do you know why? Because it hasn't actually got a name. We've only known this because we live just down the road, or like I say, we pass it all the time. There's no information to look up. It's just been here. It's just one of those places. It's unreal. Oh. Mom. Mommy Jai. Um, can you take some photos? I, there's just there's a man standing at the table. Your mum's on it. Take some photos. I'm going. Oh, can you get in? Where? See where this block is there to the right hand side? There's someone sat at it. Take a photo quick, quick, quick. No, no, that's the lady that said, I told her if she sees anything here, we're allowed to stay here. Yeah? It's alright, Danielle's panicking because um, obviously we've, we've pretty much broke in. They're so. getting arrested. Hi Tina, you saw it as well, thank God for that. They've seen the shadow, the shadow went straight past at the bottom. But then, Carl's just said, and it was weird because as he said it, I saw someone sat at that table. But I don't know if Carl... Carl, was yours on the left or the right? Because I saw him on the right. Marcus. Okay. Well, when we do the spirit box... Um, sorry, I'll talk properly enough. I'll put my teeth back in. Um, when we do the spirit box session, I'm going to call out for Marcus and see what happens. Because if it's what you feel, it's what you feel. And if he comes through, then amazing. Did you just kick a brick or did the brick come to you? Mm -hmm. All I did was turn like that, but it felt like something, it felt like something thrown. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Honey, where did you see? Oh, I was looking outside the door. Can you see him? He's on the right hand side. This is, I'm going to put my finger up. This is my finger. So don't, there. And he looks like he's got like a something. Oh, what is that? What is that? Oh! God, no! Don't want the torch! You can see it in the dark! No, I can't see anything bad. Where's he gone? No, he's gone. Do you want to move away again? He looks like legs under the table. Well, that's really weird because, yeah, I seriously. You know. He's in the other doorway now. Oh my god! You know them lights you put around your head? The torches that you put on your head? Oh God. It looks like he's wearing a miner. Yeah, that's what he looks like. Is there? Is there? Are there any mines? There's no mine. Oh, there is in Arlie. That's not far, is it? Arlie, no. Arlie's just down the road. That's a mining village. You can see him, can't you? 
Hello, can you communicate with us, please? It looks like he's got his hand on his face and he's resting on his arm. It's like he's lit. Hello? No, we, we're not going to hurt you. Can you... Who's got the torch? I swear to God, you can't get the staff, you know. <laughs> I'm not really, though. I'm harmless. I'm only joking. Okay, um... There's two. Have you got him? Please tell me you've got him. Okay, well, um, Mommy Jay's just took some photos and we think we might have him. Can still see him, clear as day. Can you all see him still? Oh, it's brilliant. Yeah, you will, yeah. They're saying that I'm bossy, I'm really not. <laughs> I'm honestly, I'm really not. <laughs> I just like winding them up. To work for the mines. Yeah, do you know what, Gillian? Right, where we, because where we are in Kozel, you know Kozel. About <sighs> 10 minutes max. You've got a whole mining village. And the reason I know that is because um, my friend from a while ago, I was saying my friend from a while, she's still my friend, but um, she lived in Arley. It's New Arley and Old Arley. And that is a whole mining village. I'm gonna look at these legs. Don't shout at me for going in, you two. Not too far. I won't go too far. I just want to get in a bit more. A small shadow walk into the door. Okay. I do actually feel like there's something watching. Not really watching. Oh my god! What, Gillian? What um? One at the table. Hi, Gail. Thank you so much for joining us. Okay, so there's a man sat at the table. Uh, shadows going past the door. Um. I am going to call out. Is your name Marcus? If your name's Marcus, can you bang, please? Is there a female presence just walked into here, please? Can you move? Can you move some wood? Can you throw some stones? There's definitely eyes watching. And I think you're so right. There's definitely... The female presence that's come in is actually very, very strong. The man that sat at the table, it was almost like he's a residual sort of energy feel. It doesn't feel that he's... Uh, it's, it's odd. It's, yeah, I can still... Can everyone still see him? You can see the flickering of his headgear. It's like a white band over his head and you can see it, you can... A cat. We've got a ghost cat. Oh God, I hope he weren't killed in the fire, bless him. Because apparently it was a really, really bad fire. I spoke to two ladies that have got a horse, um, horses down the bottom. And they said that it was horrendous. I don't even know how the building is still standing. Are you getting anything coming through, sir? I am, yeah. Yeah. I've, I've got a feeling of a lady. Um, we, again, 
standing on the left hand side I can feel her and I do get the name Margaret quite quite Christine honestly that doorway it's a shame because if you look at the oh, you can't look at the ceiling it's pitch black the bit that I'm standing in now is okay But the bottom bit, it looks like it could collapse at any time. So I can't even get down there. And that's where the fire was. Um, obviously, I'm not going into that section because the whole thing is just bent over. Can you, Debbie? What did you see, Carl? Oh, you saw the tail sticking in the air. You're getting a Peggy and I'm getting a Margaret. So this could have been the workout. It could have been a workhouse for the ladies. It could have been, a, I don't know, but I can see like pinnies, not pinnies, pinnies, but proper work pinnies, long, long, um, long dresses. Thank you, Jai. Gail, it's unreal. What can you see? Because you said it, if it's a cat, it's big. What are you seeing? Right. Did anyone hear that? Oh, what are you doing over there? I'm turning them off again. Right, over the top. Anne, you said that this man wants acknowledgement, okay? I read your message, and as I read it, I heard two footsteps over on the right hand side at the top. Two. What's happened? Okay, now the door's been open as well for ages, yeah? The ladies have literally just been standing there and the door's just shut on them. It's you with that door. It's trying to keep you out. Has it shut on you again? What was it? Was it a growl or was it more of a groan? Okay, we've got groaning going on now. <laughs> Pardon? I was going to say, yeah. leave this area before it gets too dark because of getting over the thing over there. We need to do some stuff here in the dark there. We have to. Okay. I'm being bossy again, apparently. I'm just adventurous. I can't help it. Uh, oh, sorry. So, Pegu is another name used for Mark. Cam really? Oh, my God. See, I never knew that. Margaret, if you're in here with us, can you please let us know? Right, whoever the gentleman is in this room, first of all, I'd just like to say hello. We're very much aware that you're in here with us. We mean you absolutely no harm. Can you please... Just make a noise, make a bang. Just walk, just let us know that you're with us. There's another guy outside. So we, we've got a Marcus inside, we've got Margaret. I, fe I feel that there's a lot, you know. There is a lot going on in here. It feels a very busy room, like, you can you imagine? A lot of, a lot of work. It, this, this part here, honestly, you're absolutely fine. You know, it's I just, I wouldn't go down, down there. Where the post is. Okay. That's me. Yeah, that's all right. It's just the ladies coming in if you hear anything now, okay? Right. So, 
There's been yeah, there's been footsteps up there, definitely. Okay. Apparently, Peggy is a slang name for Margaret. Oh, I yeah. picked up Margaret Peggy. and Carl. I didn't know. Yeah. I didn't have a clue. Yeah. Yeah. Carl's picked up Peggy. I've picked up Margaret. So we've definitely got a Margaret here. Okay. Who is the gentleman that's in this room with us, please? You are being watched. Yeah, this is mad. That's right, Anne. Anne's just said that because if no one's been here before and acknowledged them, they're just they'll be coming from everywhere because they're not it's not like a regular spot is it where they get to know who no. the one to one and they yeah. they come out yeah. this is like a completely new place for them yeah, yeah. yeah that's a very very good point Anne. Well, do you know what I think we should do if you fancy it? Should we go and get the spirit box and just do a little bit here? Yeah. Do you all want us to do a little bit of spirit box now? The Can see a white face at the end. Okay, I'll go and get the spirit box. What? We're just going to go out for a sec. Just going to go and get the spirit box. And uh, you feeling all right? I'm weirded out. You are weirded out. Mm. It, it's not. Right. It's not what you expect, though, is it? It's a. Uh, I wonder when it gets darker. If you're going to meet an element, I don't know. Do you know what? I actually thought the same. Yeah, yeah. Fine. I don't know. It's got a bloody weird feeling here though. Right, I'm just gonna get this bad boy. Right, do you think, could you hold it? It's going that way, so. Right, watch where you're stepping. What do you By that door? this door here. Yeah. You heard it again? Yeah. It's like someone's bored. You like that then? Okay. Okay, now this is going to get... <laughs> Right. Oh, hi. Is there anybody in here with us? Yes. Okay, and it was a man's voice. Whoa. Okay, would you, would you like to tell us your name, please? How can we help you? Help me. Okay. Oh, I have come over very cold. That was an oi. Okay. I am seriously cold, like to the bone. Yeah, yeah it's weird. <laughs> please again. Yes, I feel like um, there was a please I'm again. In a box. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> take a breath. That was to you. Well, I feel like I'm in an ice box. Are you doing that to me? Are 
Are you making Danielle calls? Are you making Danielle calls? She's not. I heard her. Yes, I did. Hello? Are you Margaret? Hi, Cheryl. Welcome. Are you Margaret? What? Is that a yes? Get out. Get out. Okay, we've had a get out, so that's a good start, isn't it? Why do you want us to get out? I want you to leave. Did you hear that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want you to leave. Why do you want now. us to leave? Why you want us to leave? Think. Can you work out? If you hear anything that we don't, please let us know. What is wrong with you? Why don't you want us in this building? We're on, we're back. Sorry about that, I don't know what happened. You're in a male domain, remember. Yeah. Stop. We'll keep that. Is that my name again? No. Was it or not? No, I think it was No. Uh, Peggy or Margaret, what do you want to be called? Get out, I heard, says Jay Savino. Yeah, we've heard that as well. Peggy. Did you hear Peggy Peggy. Then? Well done, Carl. Hi, Peggy. No. No. He's not a happy bunny, is he? No, why? Why are you so angry? Get out again. Why are you so angry? Run. I'll head run. Mm. We're not running anywhere. <laughs> they know what I want. <laughs> I hear whispering. Look, I said to you, we're not here to hurt you. We're not going to harm you in any way. We just want to communicate. No. No. Why won't you communicate with us? It's his space. Get out and run. Protecting Peggy. Is Peggy your girlfriend? Are you protecting Peggy? Peggy. Peggy again. Ask if you died from a stroke. Did you die from a stroke? <laughs> Why 
Oh, thank you. He died. He died. Okay, but did you die from a stroke? You run. Like you run. Oh, that's Sylvie. Sylvie. Peggy again. We're not going to hurt Peggy, okay? We're not here to hurt anybody. We just want to communicate with you. You died, please. No. I did. Peggy had a stroke. Peggy had a stroke. Peggy, did you have a stroke, sweetheart? Stay away from Peggy, Joanne. Says. Pardon? You don't want to stay away from Peggy. Stay away from Peggy. Mm -hmm. Is this Peggy dying? Is this Peggy dying, Charles? I feel that he's very protected over his lady, definitely. Peggy, yeah. Peggy, did you lose a child, sweetheart? You can talk to us, you know. Did you die in childbirth, Peggy? Yes. yes. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I didn't hear what you said. <laughs> Thing is, Joe, there's so many in here. Are off. There was originally... There's a man. Then there was another man that... Oh. That somebody else seen at the park. It was definitely Margaret, but I feel that there's more than one woman in here, you know. I heard a child. Heard a child. Is there a child in here with us, please? Oh! Did everybody hear that? Oh, and I've just got some problems straight in the back. Okay, enough. Oh, it's just okay. It's funny because you're right. Who spotted the child? Because you... I did. Did you? Yeah. Well, I you're standing right behind me. Yeah. I don't think it's a he. I think it's a female. I told Danielle that the story was about her the child. Oh, it's back. It's back. What's your name, sweetheart? Look. What am I looking at? Can you ask everybody on the live if they want me to ask anything, Danielle? Like? Is there anything you'd like Claire to ask out? Anything you feel coming through? I'll just tell you when you... Children's you. voice. Yeah, can you? Run, run. That You've was got run. two runs, then you're not in a line. Yeah. Why do you want us to run? Children, child's voice. Yeah. Ow. <laughs> Can you ask if it's a whole family there? Okay. Is there a whole family of you in this farm, please? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Instant yes. <laughs> Instant yes. Yep. There is Anne. Did you all go together in here? Was the fire an insurance job? What? Was the fire an insurance job?
think the fire is quite recent. Well, not recent, recent. I think it's the mo obviously a lot more recent than the, uh, yeah. the buildings. Oh, little, the little, the child's back. It's a little girl. I'm picking up a little girl. Joe says there is a reason he is protecting. Yeah, there is. Can you tell us why you don't want us to come in? You just don't you just don't want us here. Are you protecting your family as well? Is that you, Peggy? Yes. Peggy, can you tell us why your husband is in such a bad mood? Peggy. That's a good point, Gillian. Might be saying get out because the place is on yeah. fire. Or it's dangerous. Oh. Again, because if it's residual energy, yeah. it's reliving it's what living. happened yeah. at the time, wasn't it? So that is Are you trying to protect us? Are you, Kayla? Did you die in the late 1940s to early 50s? Area as well, isn't yeah. it? The whole yeah. base is just creepy as anything. Mm -hmm. I just saw a line down the bottom there, like a lot of white lines. And then one picture that's going to go. Can you. <laughs> Can you please tell us the name of the child, even though I think I know what it is? And what's the name of your son, please? Cliff. No, I don't think it's Cliff. Can you say that again, please? What? Oh, my good God. What? Did yeah. you have that? Oh, there was a flash of light on the right-hand side. There is no way that could have come in here. Oh, we need to get the phone back up. Thank you so much, spirits. We're going to come back on in a little while. Lots of respect. Thank you. Bye. There's a woman's voice in the background and it says bye. Okay, right. Oh, I'll take the phone in a minute. I feel like I've got to get away from it. Yeah, of course. Reason. Could you just tap up that in the bag for me? Yeah, right, everybody. Um, let me try and... I just want to get... If there is a little bit of light now. There we go. Okay. You can't take any photos? All right, the energies have got really, really high in here. Thanks, everybody. Um, Over there in that right-hand corner, I've only put the light on for a minute. Um, <coughs> you're getting Philip. Okay. Well, and you hit the nail on the head with the family. It's definitely protection, isn't it? Um, but there could be some residual energy here, definitely. Because it does seem like he's protecting, or he's, like you said, he's reliving what happened to them when they're in the building. Which, so everything you've all said is absolutely amazing. But what I don't get is where that flash of light came from. Um, 
Oh, sorry, I don't think I had it on up there either. No, it doesn't. It don't matter. It's one of them, and it, it always happens when you're not when you don't. I can't go in too deep, but oh, I'm sure there's something up there. Can anybody say anything to the right hand side? Because I can. No, no torches, sweet. Only because. No lights. No. No, no. Okay. Oh, you can take photos. Yeah, yeah of course you can. Um, right, just gonna the flash is gonna go off, okay? Just so you know. Oh, Wayne, how funny! He's just said it looks like his flat. That's hilarious. Well, I won't be coming round for dinner, Bab. Shadow left to right. And where do you see the arm? Because I, I keep seeing something to the right hand side. Okay, Gillian, I'll see you in a bit. We're going to have a five minute break in a minute anyway, because it's getting starting to get dark now. So we're going to use a different room in a moment. So. Oh, that funny car. Yeah, to be honest, I understand that feeling. I feel your pain. Kids playing in the house and that's it. You took screenshots. Okay, Anne, thank you so much. You can hear somebody sobbing. You know, but there is one weird feeling in here. Past the table. <laughs> no, Ellie, it's weird. It's really, really weird. Okay, Joe, you keep your ears peeled. You've got really good ears. It's definitely something right at the bottom. Danielle, deep breath. It just doesn't feel right. It won't feel right. It's going to get darker and it's going to get a little bit more doom and gloom. Danielle's freaking out because literally, to be honest, since we've been here, um, the door's shut on her and uh, she's got people standing behind her. She feels like there's someone actually kind of with her. Um, so yeah, she's feeling a bit weird. What's that call? It looks like there's someone standing at the bottom. Can you see that? Look, look. There, there. It's somebody standing there, isn't it? Hold on. I'm scared to move. That's a child. No, that's a girl. Look at the bottom at the right hand side, everyone. Can you, if, if you're there, can you wave, please? Can you, I can see her as clear as day. Oh my God. Okay, my finger's going, no, no. Don't put the flash on. Hold on. She's there. Oh, you put the flash on? What do you mean? There was a big flash of light, come past me. Oh, there was a light. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that, that was it. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't practice touch the button, it just uh, enlarged. Okay, there's a little girl standing at the bottom. Please tell me you can all see it. Okay, you'll see it when we when we look watch this back tomorrow, you will see it. I can see a misty shape. No, 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 no. There's a little girl standing right. I don't even think it's a little girl. I don't know if it's, what the hell? Anyone see that then? Please tell me you've just seen that flash up on the screen. Yeah, what what was what was that? Did you hear that breath? Okay. Debunked. Debunked. Don't do that to me, Danielle. I'm in mid flow of crazy I see ya. <laughs> you told me to take a breath. No, I did, I did. No, they told you to take a breath. <laughs> yeah, you saw it. That, that wasn't an orb, that wasn't dust. That was like something just went boom. 
straight if I can still see this please can you wave can you lift your arm up so that we know you're there okay top of the screen then did you see that what about the SLS test I'm going to get the SLS definitely oh my god now that was dust you saw that yeah that was just dust that's not what happened twice yeah the white dress you can see it can't you but she's not moving which i don't like because if she moves a little bit we can there she is can you see her clear as dark there she is hold on is she turning around a little bit or is that just my eyes uh, there's lots of bangs in the other building. She is, her head's moving. Now that was dust again. Don't you think so, Carl? Don't you don't you trust um It is like she's holding, but if you watch her head, all of a sudden it's like she'll she'll turn a little bit. Yeah, I know I can. And there's no light on down there at all. Like no light at all. There's not even a glimpse down the bottom, it's pitch black. I'm looking at it and it's pitch black. But there is definitely a girl there. And I can't take my eyes off her. Okay, Carl, thank you so much for joining. Can everybody still see that little girl? Or oh, little teenage girl? I don't know, I can't work it out. Little girl? What was the name? Carol. Carol, yeah. Carol, is that you? Something, just doing something over here beyond my shoulder. Okay, I'll try to Carol, can you please just move a tiny bit just so we know? Don't be scared. I'm sure she's moving. It could be Carl. Could be. But it's as clear as day, isn't it? And I don't know what that face is because there is no light on down there. It's literally pitch black at the bottom. You've just seen the flash of light, yeah? Uh, flash did go off out here. I'm telling no, you. no, uh, this was the, a while ago. Oh, okay. There was something really weird that came up to the, um, it came up to the, the phone. But it, you know, like an orb, when you see the trail, yeah. it didn't do that. It was just like a ball just appeared and there was nothing. So there was no oh. trace to it. There's a flash of light, Tina, at the bottom. Oh my God, I can't wait to look back at this and get some screenshots and, oh my God. Ellie, you saw a flash of light. Oh my God, yeah. That little girl's still there. She's still there. There's nothing there. It's a wall with nothing on it. I'm looking at the wall right now. It's just, your mom, look at the bottom on the right hand side. See where the concrete bit is by the door? There's just one yeah. strip of concrete. Yeah. That's it. And standing there is a girl. I think she's moved. There she is. I can see. Oh, you see her? I did see that light. What was that? That's what I mean. These things keep keep flashing in front of us. But it's not dust. Not to the naked eye. I just saw a light flash. And honestly, right, you can see that when the dusk has passed, you know what it is. You can see it when you're looking. Just, just it's not that. It's like instant flashes. I don't even know what they are. Normally, when you get a good orb, it's a good orb, and it, it shows off a little bit. But these are just like bang. Just, a just flash random, flash. yeah. I did see that. So. She is moving, isn't she? 
So now that was dust, by the way. Yeah. So that was definitely dust. See, um, I don't know. We don't know what it is. Can I say thank you? You all right, Danielle? Yeah. What was that? No. What? It looked like a light or something. Yeah. You saw the light? Or like a wisp. Yeah. Was it in the corner yeah. again? Um, no, it was nearer to us. You're getting pressure, Carl. Do you know? I'm sure there was a shadow down the bottom there. Hi, Dawn. How are you? Bailey, thank you so much as well. Dawn, Bailey, really appreciate you joining us. Um, yeah, we're getting a, a lot of a very unusual activity. If you look down the bottom to the right hand side, uh, we've got a, we think is a little girl, but I don't know as it keeps changing, which to be honest, I'm not sure. Okay, we're in um, we're in Kozal, and um, we're actually at it's like two two barns. One's over the road, and one's here. Derelict buildings. Um, we've climbed over a fence, and in we are. It's not the safest of places, uh, but yes, it's very active. Um, lots of bangs. Danielle's had the door shut on her twice, and the door doesn't shut. It stays open. I, I, honestly, it's ridiculous. Um, there's a lot to go through, but it's amazing. Lots of bangs from the, building, lots lots of bangs from the other building, which we haven't even gone in yet. Chains are clanging. Yeah, chains are clanging. Um, yeah, it's, it's, I don't even know where to start. I really don't know where to start. It's just... Like I say, to all of you paranormal investigators, I hope I've actually given you a, a location if you want to try it before it gets demolished because they do that to all of these fantastic places. So what I'll do after, I mean, tomorrow, I'll send you um, an address. And like I say, just come down. Get in here quick. Because, yeah, there is a shadow. And that, do you know what's weird? Right, that, that little boy, is it? It's not a girl. Kayla, I can't, sweetheart. The uh, the roof's about to collapse in down the bottom. It's not safe because that's where the fire was. I have to stay at the top end. Hi, Cheryl. You've seen a flash as well? Yeah, yeah. There's, honestly, it's ridiculous. I mean, that's that's a fly and that's dust, okay? Uh, there was footsteps, eh? There was footsteps behind Danielle now. What did you see? What did you... What did you feel, Carl? Okay, that's a fly in front of the screen. That's... The shadows moved. Yeah, I saw it yeah, yeah, yeah. By the door. By the, okay. Yeah. Can you see? I can see something peeking around the door. I think we've got a lurker. I don't like lurkers. I don't like lurkers either. Can I take a photo? Yeah. Mine flashing in front of her. Yeah. Right, the That's flash is going to go in a minute. It's just a photo. Yeah, don't worry, we'll be careful, I promise. Okay. Yeah, Ellie, it did. But if you if you all look to the right oh look to the right hand side of where the door should be, can anybody see a man standing there peering round? Look. His body's gone back and his head's still there. Oh, that's what you can see. It's a definite lurker, that, isn't it? You don't need to lurk in the background. You can come forward, you know. We're not going to... See, his head's more prominent now. Oh, my God, his body's coming forward. 
We just want to say hi. That is it. We're not going to hurt you, okay? Nothing, nothing bad. We just want to know that you're okay and that you feel that you can communicate with us. Don't worry, Ben. If you want to come here next week, you can come here next week. I'll bring you and Kayla back here, okay? Hi, Robert. He's still there. Can you all see him at the bottom? It's as if he's... Okay, this is going to sound really... It's as if he's naked. It's as if he's actually got no clothes on. I'm trying to keep my... But he keeps going behind the wall. Yeah, look, look, he's gone behind the wall. And then all of a sudden, look, here he comes, he's coming out. Please come forward. I promise you, we're not going to hurt you. We just want to communicate. We want to prove that Yeah, Pauline, here. yeah. We want to prove your existence. Oh, Danielle, honestly. You, honestly. You're right, it's like the crooked man. Is he the one, Carl, that I need to watch out for? Yeah, um, I'm pretty much ready to go. Do you know what I mean? He does look like he's got any clothes on. Right, okay. What we're going to do... It's still lurking, look, he's still lurking. Did you see that flash then? Oh, God. Where's he gone? No, he's still there. He's still there. Right, I'm going to tell him to back off. Now look, he's, he's coming forward, isn't he? Tell him to back off, Claire. Right, you need to back off now. Thank you for showing yourself, but that is enough now. Good. You need to back off and stay where you are. Is he fully showing himself? He's coming more and more and more forward. Okay. Right, we're going out of here now just for a bit because... I need to drop my phone then. Sorry, everyone. Uh, yeah. yeah Woo! Okay, that, that was weird. I'm actually sweating. I'm, I'm fully sweating. I'm that freezing. You're freezing and I'm sweating. I'm I swear freezing. to God. No, I'm freezing. I'm still freezing. Have Danielle stand in front of the camera. Right, Danielle, hey. stay where you are, sweet. I'm absolutely freezing. Be careful with him bad feeling yeah Bailey totally get it yeah. honestly it, do you know what in there even though we was being told to get out when we saw that man sitting at the table I don't know I have my back it, to it <clears throat> it didn't feel really like you wanted to run no, but it, it was just worse. a bit mm, hesitant you're just a bit hesitant but then all of a sudden as soon as I saw that lurker I hate a lurker Joe don't we hate lurkers Bab my mum hates lurkers I Danielle do. you'll learn to hate lurkers I hate everything. Because they're just not good. <laughs> she's not. She's not like that. Um, oh, everyone said hi, Danielle. Hey. I'm being blinded. By the Sorry. Light. <laughs> okay. Why did you want me on the screen? I don't like having Sorry. my back to that. I think Carl wanted to meet you. Oh, you... hey, Carl. Hi, Emma. No, we really don't. Um, we don't. Okay. Yeah. See him peeking out constantly. Yeah, it looked like he had no clothes on, which to me is a little bit... Uh, yeah. Mm, mm. Yeah. Okay, Joe. Joe, what, what are the name of those... <clears throat> um, sorry, I'm going to sound really thick now. It's just I have actually had the biggest mental block ever. Those uh, creatures that show themselves as white with no clothes on and they've got red eyes what are they called please give me the name before I've I've gone blank I'm not saying he's got red eyes there was there was no red eyes I just want to know what the name of them is can you remember oh god I've gone blank right Carl just said if you do a call out you may feel a child hold your hand who me do it then okay my hand is free. Is there a child there? 
Do you want to come towards me? Robert said hello, Danielle. Hi, Robert. Elementals. No, no, not elementals. The, 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 oh, God. Sometimes you see them and they crawl along floors as well. There's a child there. Would you like to come towards me? I am usually cold to the bone. I cannot tell you how freezing cold. Hi, Naomi. No, no, I've, I'm boiling. Oh, I've gone really hot. I've gone the complete opposite to you guys. I'm, I was going to stop saying guys. I hate that. Not you. I, I don't know. I feel weird. Mm. Huh? Good. Okay. A creeper. I don't know. I'll find the name and I'll post it because honestly, it'll drive me nuts if I don't. Yeah, shapeshifter. I know the sh this is something else. I'm not. Oh, will it'll come to me? Oh, it's just a mental block. Okay, look, do you know what? We're going to have 10 minutes now, if you don't mind, because I think what we're going to do is go over to... Is it that room? That okay, what that we'll that do one? is there. we're going to go into this one room. There's banging, there's chains rattling. We just need 10 minutes. Danielle's probably going to have a nervous breakdown thinking about <laughs> going in that room. I'm not going in it. <laughs> okay, well, you can stand on the outside. I will, I promise. Uh, we're definitely going to do that. We just need just 10 minutes yeah. to get our bearings, yeah, yeah, and have a bit of a breather. Mm -hmm. We'll do that room, and then we're going to cross over the road, and we're going to walk around that giant, giant, whatever it is, coach house oh, or whatever. So, yeah, please all come back. Just give us 10 minutes, and that will be it. That will be it. We'll carry on. <sighs> yeah, we break. Uh, there's nowhere to we, though, but, yeah. <laughs> right thank you all so much carl everybody on there just 10 minutes i promise we'll be back okay we talk. love you all and uh okay yeah oh 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 sorry i'm oh. too little <laughs> hey, i'm trying to say it right yeah um this this place is a little bit bonkers to say the least but it's so cool I'm going to post the address anyway, and you're going to love it. Get down here before it gets demolished, okay? Ten minutes. Bye-bye.